We've all been there before. You're playing a video game, you get stuck on a level, and you keep dying over and over and over again. It is the most frustrating thing on the planet. Now, imagine you're trapped in the game, completely immersed, and you can't get out until you win. This book is kind of like Groundhog's Day mixed with a child-friendly version of Game of Thrones. In it, you follow the main character, Janine Belisario, as she goes to an arcade, starts playing a game when the gaming equipment gets sabotaged by protesters. This puts Janine's game on the clock. She is trapped and she has to win quickly, otherwise she will suffer dire consequences. The book's a little bit vague about the dire consequences. She's either going to end up brain dead or actually dead, but dire consequences nonetheless. In the game, you're playing as a sheep herder who finds out that your father's the king, but don't get too happy because he's dead, but don't get too sad because he left you the entire kingdom. And all you gotta do to win the game is get to your coronation ceremony, which is a lot, sounds a lot easier than it actually is because you have to avoid your murderous half family who's trying to kill you because they didn't get to be king. There's an army of ghosts, an army of barbarians, a fire-eating, man-eating dragon, a statue that wants to chop off your head if you don't give it good enough poetry, and general political unrest. Super easy. All the characters in this book change from friend to foe depending on the decisions that Janine makes. It makes them endlessly hilarious, and it makes them 3D characters with real believable motivations. There is a thousand ways to play the game and win in getting you to the end of the book, but there's also a thousand ways to die, and we get to see a ton of those in the book. They're always hilarious and a lot of fun. This book has something for everyone. It's a cute little fantasy mixed in a science fiction bow. It's wonderful. It's hilarious. Call well, calling this book funny would be like calling the ocean wet. It's got dry, fast-paced humor, but it's mixed with the perfect amount of suspense because you never know who's lurking around the corner getting ready to kill Janine. I love this book. I know you will love this book. It is Air Parent by Vivian Van Veld. And the next time you play a video game, just think to yourself, if my life depended on this video game, on winning it, how long would I survive?